Hi, I'm Christoph Nivot. I look after data and analytics at the FNB. Today we're going to be talking about all things data, analytics and even AI. Uh, I'm Rob, so I look after the contact center as well as advisory. And basically advisory is client solutions, client value propositions, and just making sure that everything we put out to the market as FNB speaks to client needs and is deeply thought through and adds significant value to customers' lives. So Rob, obviously we're trying to really elevate the role of data and analytics in the bank and we created these roles Chief Data Analytics Officer as opposed to the more traditional focus purely um, on data itself. But maybe your perspective on data analytics and how it drives value in your business. We have the ability to inform a customer that they can save X rand a month by changing some behavior. So instead of withdrawing cash, go and swipe your card. So we've got very rich data products that we can leverage to give that deep customer understanding at a hyper segment level but even at an individual customer level. Yeah that's that's amazing and a lot of that data we're starting to use as well if you look at the contact center so you call in we can do voice recognition we can figure out where to 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 move a customer and then for the complex things then we have the human being that can that can interact. So Rob, when we talk about data models and especially AI, a topic that always comes up is trust. I think the starting point really is that the customers must feel safe on the platform. So safe from fraud, from phishing attacks, from any other attack. I mean, that is really prevalent nowadays. And our platform really uses rich data to ensure that we can really, really drive and avoid fraud and make customers as safe um, as is possible. How do you see the, the use of these models panning out in, in, in your space? So, I mean, I've actually got a personal example where a transaction happened on my card. Um, and obviously with models running in the background, FNB thought it was a suspicious transaction. And I got a, a, a notification to say, this transaction is about to go off your account. Please confirm it is you. And it wasn't. So I said no. And that uh, transaction was, was declined. So for me, that's powerful. To summarize. Do we use data analytics and even AI in FNB? Absolutely. Do we do it to give you a better contextual experience, to limit your fraud losses, and to give you better access to products? Absolutely. Do we do it in a responsible way, considering fairness, privacy requirements, legal requirements, and ethics? Absolutely. We are your trusted advisor at, at FNB. We leverage data big data um, and AI in order to give customers the most value, understand customers better and be able to deliver a better experience overall for, for customers.